हेलो गाइस हाउ आर यू आई होप यू डूइंग वेल एंड यू आर वाचिंग माय यूट्यूब चैनल एडवांस टेक्नोलॉजी बैराना इन टुडे सेशन गाइस आई एम गोइंग टू अपग्रेड द फर्मवेयर विद कैटलिस्ट थर्टी एट हंड्रेड सीरीज स्विचेज एंड द प्रोसेस इज सेम व्हाट आई शो यू इन द प्रीवियस रिकॉर्डेड सेशन ऑफ कैटलिस्ट नाइनटी बट वी विल डू इट ऑन थर्टी एज वेल एंड वी विल सी हाउ इट परफॉर्म ओके सो आई विल कनेक्टेड विद माई switch and the model for my switch is i will make the same command show platform the show platform will provide me the model of my switch which is 3850 24 ps with the current io 1664 okay i'll do the same thing i'll go to the cisco website and i put the part number and i have the model 3850 24 ps and the latest release which is the stable one is 1628 this ios i already uh, downloaded and uh, copied to my usb flash and my usb flash is connected with my catalyst switch usb port okay so the command is show usb flash 0 and it will provide me uh, the file which i have downloaded so uh, the next thing i will do i will put uh, i will remove first the unnecessary file the command is install remove inactive it will evaluate my flash and if it found any unnecessary or unused file it will remove it so let's see okay no extra package or provisioning files found on media so nothing to clean but if it found it will ask me and i will make it yes and it will remove unnecessary file okay so the next command is to copy uh, this uh, ios from the usb uh, to my flash for this one i will give a command copy usb flash 0 to flash or i will put it boot flash colon and the name of the file let me check over here what is the name of the file yes cat 3k yes it is the same file okay i believe there is some difference in the command here it is usb flash to only flash okay so i put the destination Okay guys iOS is uh, copy to the flash the next i will do the same command for dir flash steric dot bin okay and i found uh, the uh, the my iOS in my existing flash now i will do the verification verify slash md 5 flash and the name of the file okay it will check the md5 and it will match with the with the md5 value available on the website i will show you now so this is the md5 which is started from 84 and end with fb so i'll i go over here and i will click on this uh, side it is the same md5 checksum 84 and 2 fb so if it is matched and uh, it will found that there is no compromise with the with the there is no manipulation actually in the, during the copy of the ios so this uh, is pass as well this is very important to perform the next thing i will put command no system i'll go sorry to the configuration no 
system boot all okay okay this command is not available let me check now this command is not available in 3850 so i will just put boot system flash package okay this command is work now so i change the boot order for this one the next command i'll put it no boot manual okay then i'll make it exit i'll make it write memory configuration is safe especially for the for the boot variable i'll put the command show boot okay so all the variables are correct so now i will uh, install this uh, ios from inactive to active and i will put uh, my router my switch basically to take the new ios for this one the command is install add files flash i'll put the name of the image sorry install add file flash let me copy the name okay activate commit okay So now the process is started. So guys, the process is same uh, on 3850 as well, same as 9300 or 9200. It will check for the, all the members of the stack. If it found, it will automatically copy it on all the stack members and it will do a reboot in one shot, in one order. Okay, so you does not need to put any command in case you have a stack uh, of two, three, four, or five switches, except it will take some extra time to upload the iOS uh, on the all stack members and make a reboot. I'll make it yes.
so guys the reload is started now finally we are near to close this uh, ios upgrade my catalyst switch is going to boot now and i hope everything will be smooth and successful guys finally uh, we have done this upgrade let's verify show platform and we'll see yes we have done the upgrade with 16128 which was our target 16128 okay so we have done this uh, firmware upgrade successfully on catalyst 385024 pss switch I hope you have enjoyed this video and please uh, don't forget to subscribe and like this channel and if you like this video provide your your positive feedback so stay tuned and see you with another video very soon take care allah hafiz bye bye